Bill and I talking the other night off air uh, and just wondering, have uh, your shot looks like you're, you're getting it away quicker. Have you been working on it or is it something that has been uh, at the forefront of your work in the past couple of months? Uh, not particularly. No, I think, you know, at the end of practice, we'll always do a few shooting drills here and there, but um, no, I, I don't think too, I'm not changing too much. Just, you know, uh, early on when, you know, maybe I'm not scoring as much as I'd like to, I guess the thought process is just get pucks to the net quicker and good things will happen. And talking about uh, a little bit on air about uh, Cali Kosala, what's he been like as a center for uh, you and Nick? Yeah, no, he's, he's been great for us up the middle. Uh, you know, obviously I'm playing with two really smart, skilled players, so it's, it's made the game a lot easier, but no, he's reliable on both ends of the ice and he's, he's really creative with the puck and uh, makes a lot of like high IQ plays. Next question goes to Joshua Cook. Go ahead, Joshua. Hey, Kenny, you've been moved um, at the trade deadline before you understand what that's like. Um, does it get any easier for you as the trade deadline approaches? Uh, yeah, to be honest, like I think the more times you go through it and as a professional, it just, I guess maybe when you're a younger pro, you might think about it more, but you just realize in this business, there's so little that you control. So for me, my whole thing is just day at a time. So not, nothing really changes for me. You know, you, you watch Nick Robertson day to day, and you also are in the unique position because you understand how difficult it is to make the jump from the AHL to the NHL. When you watch Nick play, what gives you confidence that, that one day he will be able to make that jump? Uh, just to be looking like his raw skill set. Like, I, I think he's still so early in, in learning the pro game. And if you can see what he can create and do at this level before he's maturing as a professional in terms of like how he plays the game, it's pretty impressive. So, you know, him, SDA, those guys, like, I think uh, the, the sky's the limit for their potential.